Hi, I'm Bob. Welcome to the Stata course on data management today. We will talk about how to create dummy variables in Stata. A dummy variable is also called a binary variable or an indicator variable. It takes on only two values, 0 and 1. These two values are used to put each observation into one of two groups represented by 0 and 1. For example, we can use a dummy variable to describe whether a worker is full-time or part-time. We use a dummy variable full-time to indicate full-time workers. Full-time equals 1 means full-time workers. Full-time equals 0 represents part-time workers. There were three main methods to create dummy variables in Stata. We have already touched on the first two methods in previous topics. Let's have a review. We continue to use our course dataset, bob.dta. We find a variable, schooling. It is the years of schooling completed by the workers in the sample. It ranges from 6 to 17. If we defined a person receiving at least some college education if she has more than 12 years of schooling, we can create a dummy variable called college based on the existing variable schooling. The dummy variable college equals 1 if the variable schooling is greater than 12. It equals 0 otherwise. We can use the generate and replace commands to do that. We type generate college equals 0 if schooling is less than a dot. We create a new constant variable college with 0 as all its values except for the missing values. We use the if condition here because the schooling variable has missing values. The missing values are coded as positive infinity in Stata and written as a dot. So we need to be careful only to create a dummy variable college from long missing years of schooling. Then we type replace college equals 1 if schooling is greater than 12 and less than a dot. We can tabulate the dummy variable college and check whether it has the correct number of observations as shown in the command summarize. The second way to create a dummy variable is to employ the read code command with the generate option. We type read code followed by schooling and put the recode rule in the parenthesis. In this case, 6 to 12 years of schooling are coded as 0 and 13 to 17 years of schooling are coded as 1. Then we use the generate option to create a new dummy variable college2. Execute that and tabulate college2. We see exactly the same result as the dummy variable college we created by the first method. Finally, let me show you how to create dummy variables from a categorical variable. We should be able to distinguish between categorical and dummy variables. The former takes on several values, such as 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. The latter has only two values, 0 and 1. Any categorical variables can be divided into several dummy variables. Our dataset has a categorical variable, race, which has four categories, white, black, Asian, and other. Let's say we want to split this categorical variable into four separate 
dummy variables. In other words, we want to create four dummy variables. The first indicates whether the worker is white. It equals one if she is white and zero otherwise. The second dummy represents black. It equals one if the worker is black and zero otherwise, and so on. To create dummy variables from a categorical variable, we use the tabulate command and the generate option. We type tabulate race. After the comma, we use the generate option and put the dummy variable's name in the parentheses. Stata will automatically create four new dummy variables for us. They are race dummy one, race dummy two, race dummy three, and race dummy four. Let's tabulate them. We see that race dummy one takes on two values. One means white, and zero means long white. In race dummy two, one means black, and zero means long black. For race dummy three, one indicates Asian, and zero indicates long Asian. For race dummy four, one represents other races, and zero means white, black, or Asian. If we sum up these four dummy variables, the sum equals one, which is a constant. Here we use the display command to show the result of a calculation. The fact that the sum of the four dummy variables is a constant, or equivalently, any one dummy variable can be expressed as the function of other dummy variables. Results in a well-known problem in regression modeling: the dummy variable trap. It occurs when we use all four dummy variables in the regression. In our case, for example, when we regress the log hourly wage on all four race dummy variables, the data informs us that race dummy four is omitted because of. Perfect collinearity. Today we have learned three ways to create dummy variables in Stata. We can use the generate and replace commands to create a dummy variable based on an existing continuous variable. We can also use the recode command with the generate option. The third method is to create several dummy variables from a categorical variable using the tabulate command with the generate option. Thank you so much for watching this video. See you tomorrow on the next topic. Take care. Thank you for watching this video and subscribing to my YouTube channel. See you next time.